Today we're going to compare the Baby Jogger City Mini and the Baby Jogger City Mini GT. Both of these strollers fall into kind of a strange size category between a full-size stroller and a dedicated travel stroller. Um, the Baby Jogger City Mini comes in at about half the price of the City Mini GT, uh, but for that reduction in price you're also going to get a reduction in the materials and the mechanisms on the stroller itself. So most noticeable difference or the difference that I notice the most when I'm using these strollers is the wheels. The City Mini has this lighter weight wheels that are covered in foam and um, it's not quite as sturdy or provide as good shock absorption as the Baby Jogger City Mini GT which has foam filled tires. Uh, you also will notice while using the stroller that the wheels are a bit rattlier on the City Mini and this is because the axle and ball bearing setup is not as high quality on the City Mini as it is on the City Mini GT. The City Mini also does not have an adjustable handle as you would see on the City Mini GT uh, and the front swivel mechanism is uh, also of inferior construction such that uh, the front wheel begins to get loose and can have troubles wobbling over time. Um, lastly, in terms of mechanical differences, the City Mini has the older foot brake setup while the GT has the newer handbrake setup. Uh, I do notice that with proper maintenance, the foot brake uh, has less of a tendency to fail, but it's not like the handbrake fails all the time either, and it is quite handy to have it uh, a little bit higher up. When choosing between these two strollers, I would recommend that you think about what use you, choose, you want to put the stroller to. So if you're looking for a travel stroller, the City Mini is lighter weight and uh, slightly smaller and of course cheaper. And um, if you're using it as a travel stroller, you're of course not using it all the time. So the uh, differences in terms of materials and me uh, mechanisms will have less wear on the stroller. If you want to use the stroller all the time with the City Mini, you will after, uh, after a short while notice that some of these elements start to wear down. Uh, the stroller will feel looser and more rattly than uh, if you were to pick the City Mini GT. If you are, however, buying a smaller stroller because you want something that's a bit lighter weight and smaller than a full-size stroller such as the City Elite, uh, but you want something that you can use daily and uh, is going to be a bit more robust and have the longevity you would expect from a full-size stroller, then I would recommend the City Mini GT uh, because for the price, it has a lot of the same sort of structural elements as you would get on uh, any of the full-size strollers from the Baby Jogger line. Uh, so in general, this is a higher quality stroller, uh, but it is for a higher price and it is slightly heavier and slightly larger than the City Mini. Uh, both of these are good strollers. Um, so I'm not going to just say buy the GT over the City Mini, but I would say that uh, if you're looking for a travel stroller, go with the City Mini. And if you're looking for something for daily use, that's a bit smaller and lighter, then I would recommend going for the City Mini GT. Uh, we hope this video has been helpful. If it has been, we ask you to subscribe as it helps us to continue making videos in the future. Thank you.